Hola, Ore. Good to see you. Today, I want to share with you how you can create real-time news videos with free AI tools. And I tell you for a fact that you will not be able to differentiate what I'm about to create and CNN news. So if that sounds like what you're going to love, let's get right in. All right. So the first thing we want to do is to go to Perplexity. Perplexity is an AI tool just like ChatGPT. The reason why I prefer Perplexity in this case is because Perplexity gives me real life information like what is currently going on. All right. So we're going to go to Perplexity and then ask Perplexity to tell us what news is currently trending in the tech industry. Here is the answer. You can see here there are many headlines provided by Perplexity about trending tech topics news currently right if you check this other side you, you have additional sources to confirm this news so i'm going to click on this microsoft has deepmind co-founder all right that is done and here it takes us to the source of this information as you can see here this news came online on march 20th 2024 which is the same day i'm making this video so i'm going to copy this headline and then ask perplexity to create new script for this headline as you can see here the job is done okay all right now the job is done i'm going to copy this and then paste it in my google doc or notepad right now the next thing i want to do is to head over to chat gpt and then ask chat gpt to create image prompt for this new scripts and then I will paste the new script and then wait for ChatGPT to generate what I asked for. Yeah, this is done. These are all the prompts we need to generate images for our news, right? I'm going to copy that and then paste it again in my Google Doc or Notepad, all right? Now, the next thing is to generate images for our news videos. So for this, I'm going to use Leonardo.ai, all right? So I'll head over to Leonardo.ai and then if you don't have an account you're gonna log in and then you're gonna find something like this so you click on create new image all right so i'm gonna copy any of those prompts and then paste it here and allow it to generate so one of the prompt was to generate a background for our news right so you can see this is the background it has generated so you can go ahead and pick the one that best fit what you're looking for all right and then you click on it this icon is gonna pop up and then you click on this other one to download your image all right so you do the same for all other prompt okay now this site is done we are actually done with creating our images like i said you do the same for every other prompt okay now we've gotten our images and new scripts ready the next thing we want to do is to generate a talking avatar to read the news right to do this we're going to head over to agent ai so you're going to go to agent ai in your browser and search for that so it is going to take you here so here you want to click on get started for free all right so when that is done you want to log in with your email or gmail and choose your gmail account right and then you want to click on get started right so here you're going to answer a couple of questions and then when you're done with answering a couple of questions it's going to take you here and then you want to start creating right by clicking here to create okay now you click there uh you're going to remove that okay now you can see this we have tons of avatars that you can choose from to create whatever kind of video you want to create all right for me i think i'm going to choose this guy with red tie right here right okay that is done great all right, the next thing I want to do is to paste my script. The script I copied from Perplexity, actually, right? So I'm going to paste it here. And this is it. The script is pasted right here, okay? All right, that is done. If I want to review or see how it's going to sound, I'm going to click on this little icon here, this play button here, to actually play the script and then and see what it sounds like all right that is actually done i'm gonna scroll down to the timeline i want to get there i want to click this little three icon here then this will pop up and what i want to do here is that i just want to change the background to green so that i can remove it anytime right okay so i want to click on scene background and this will pop up this color guy gonna pop up right here so i want to move this to green and then yeah move this to 
control whatever kind of green deeper green dark green light green whatever i want okay that is actually done yeah you want to scroll up again and then see where the app submit you want to submit this video so that you can download it okay you click on submit yeah a video is being created so you wait for a few seconds and then whoa a video is created so the video is ready you click on the video you're gonna find this download button right there so when you click on that you download your video right okay we are done with this part now let's get to the next part okay now we are adding over to Canva to look for news intro that we will use at the beginning of our news right so you come to Canva and you type into the search per news intro all right so when you type that in you're gonna see tons of intros that you can use for your news so you want to pick the one that is free once you're able to find the one that fits what you want you're going to download that right into your device all right we are able to get enough resources for our news video right now we are going to use CapCut to organize everything we've gathered right so all right we're going to bring in all the images and videos we've created and then adjust them edit them in a way that fits what we want okay but if you are actually new to CapCut, you may not really understand what is going on here so i'll suggest you watch my CapCut tutorial video i will leave the link in the description of this video right viola we are done with this creation and this is what it's look like in a strategic move within the ai sector microsoft has named mustafa suleiman co-founder of DeepMind as the CEO of its new AI unit. This appointment signals Microsoft's commitment to advancing artificial intelligence technologies. Suleiman's expertise and experience in AI development, particularly from his time at DeepMind, a prominent AI research lab, position him well to lead Microsoft's AI initiatives. This decision underscores Microsoft's focus on innovation and leadership in the rapidly evolving field of artificial intelligence. Stay tuned for further updates on how this appointment will shape Microsoft's AI strategies and impact the tech industry. And that is it. The job is done. So if you want to see more videos like this, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and then turn on the bell icon to get more videos ideas. See you in my next video.